Hi friends, in this video I am going to discuss about uh, CRC calculation that is cyclic redundancy check calculation that is uh, uh, used in Modbus RTU protocol. This is a 16 bit CRC and this protocol is widely used in industry for the automation process because of its advantages like it's an open protocol, it's a proven and it's a widely spread protocol. So this is a protocol is employing a master slave technique here you can see the master is sending the query and the slave is responding to that query the master if you it can be uh, taken as example as uh, HMIR SCADA and the slave it can be a PLC so whenever the master is asking some data it will send in the form of the bytes so the device address is correspond to the address of the PLC function code whether it is a digital input it has to send that is PLC has to send whether it is analog input the function code will give that information and these are the bytes and these along with that there is error checking uh, bytes that is 16 bit CRC that is sent along with the uh, uh, the bytes so what the PLC will do so it will take these bytes and it will again calculate the CRC for these bytes and it will check with the received and calculated uh, CRC whenever the both the values are matched then only the uh, PLC will uh, give response to the master query this is the two table of exclusive which is used in uh, calculation of the CRC so 0 means 0 means 0 0 1 1 1 0 1 1 1 means 0 the modbus crc polynomial is x power 16 plus x power 15 plus x power 2 plus 1 so and the coefficient of this polynomial will form uh, uh, the 16 bit uh, value so here you can see so the coefficient of uh, this uh, is forming uh, the 16 bit value so the higher uh, order that is x power 16 coefficient is omitted so remaining uh, coefficients uh, will form the modbus uh, crc uh, polynomial so and this modbus crc polynomial is 8005 so and for calculation of this crc in modbus we are using the reflected polynomial of this 8005 so this is 8005 so and the reflection of this is 101 so this is reflected so and it is becoming a 001 and this is the polynomial which we are using in uh, uh, modbus rtu for calculating the 16 bit crc and this is the procedure for calculating the crc so this uh, uh, same i am discussing in the graphical calculation of uh, the 16 bit crc these are the steps we need to follow in calculating the crc so this first the initial 16 bit crc register is loaded with all ones that is uh, all f's in hexadecimal and the data that first byte which need to be transmitted is uh, exclusive odd with the lower bits of the 16 bit crc register and uh, the exclusive odd operation between these two so here 10 zero means 1 0 1 1 means 0 so 10 zero is 1 so and, uh, this exclusive odd operation is performed and the resultant uh, is the final uh, CRC register so on this register the shift operation need to be performed to the right side so on the MSP bit is filled with 0 so this is the first shift operation so 8 shift operation need to be performed for 1 byte that is, that is having 8 bits so whenever the LSP bit that is coming out if it is 1 so we need to perform exclusive or operation of the CRC register with the CRC polynomial this is the CRC polynomial that is A001 so exclusive or of this here we can see so 101 101 so and similarly it is like that and 11 is 0 so similarly if uh, the C L LSB is 0 so you need to need not uh, perform any exclusive or operation just we need to continue the shift operation so after completing shift 1 so this is shift 2 again the LSB bit that is coming out is 1 here you can see the MSB bit is filled with uh, 0 again a CRC operate that excludes our operation is performed with the CRC polynomial and again the shift 3 the shift 3 LSB is 0 so we need to con continue the shift operation and shift 4 is again LSB is 1 so again need to perform exclusive or and this process is continued and the final after performing shift 8 so the resultant CRC register value is the CRC value so which is having 213F in hexa value so this is we have taken example for one byte so we do in modbus protocol number of bytes are transmitted so the process is same so the modbus device what it will do it will along with this data so it will send the lower byte of the crc first this is 3f is the lower byte and higher byte is uh, next and uh, this value you can check uh, 
in so here we can check whatever the value which you have calculated is correct or not so here this is 16 bit crc and whatever the value you have taken in example is 82 then hexa value so for this is the mod bus um, crc 16 bit uh, crc and the result is 213f so which we have calculated and here it is matching so similarly you can add uh, any number of bytes this is hexadecimal or uh, so this is our ASCII also we can add so here we have selected a XR so for these three bytes what is the CRC we can see so the CRC is changing so it's a CRC is 4B1D so like this we can uh, manually calculate and check the calculated CRC with this uh, uh, website value thank you for watching my video